Hey friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my desk tour. So this is actually my work laptop. It is much fancier than my personal laptop. This is the Dell XPS. It's Intel Core i9. It has a bunch of RAM that I probably do not use on a regular basis. Um, it's also like, I think one or two terabytes um, SSD. And I use this obviously only for work. But of course I have my lovely lo-fi girl who I listen to, who is my best friend at work when I'm just listening to lo-fi. And honestly, my laptop is pretty lightweight. I don't have too many other attachments. I do have a monitor that I'll use occasionally, which sits right up there. And this monitor is a very wide, I don't remember exactly how wide it is, but I use it occasionally when I need to. Most of the time I try to stick to one screen just because just because I don't prefer to use another keyboard and I just have my laptop screen in front of me at all times. I know there's other security professionals out there who always have, you know, a monitor on, but I am not one of those people. I'll use it when I really need to, but but typically my little laptop screen is enough for me. But of course I do zoom it out, so so normally my screen is also very small in terms of text. And when it comes to my mouse, I think this one is a pretty normal wireless mouse. This is from Logitech and it is the G305. I use this when I'm traveling or just something very lightweight. I do have another ergonomic mouse, but I don't typically use it because, because it is wired. So I'll kind of switch between if I have wrist pain or anything like that. Um, but typically I don't, so, so normally you'll probably see me just using my Logitech mouse. And then over here I have, of course, my lovely Poly speakerphone. And first, I'd like to thank Poly for sponsoring today's video, featuring their PolySync 20 speakerphone. This super sleek addition to your work from home setup really levels up your game in terms of audio, whether it's for a meeting, listening to music while working, and everything in between. I love how versatile it is and how easy it is to set up. I literally plugged it in and it was ready to use. Did I mention it's an all-in-one portable speakerphone, portable charger. It focuses on your voice, not background noise, with a multi-microphone shareable array for echo and noise reduction with up to 20 hours of battery life. It's also water and dust resistant. This one is actually a programmable button and I currently use it as is for playing music. For example, just for my lo-fi hip hop. <laughs> Next is for Microsoft Teams. It's just a convenient little button to open up the Teams app on your laptop, which is so, so convenient rather than having to open it. Typically I have probably more than 10 to 20 windows open. So it's very convenient to just have this right here. And this of course is pretty self-explanatory, lower volume, higher volume, and then muting yourself during a call, which is also very convenient at the click update button. And then this button right here is for Siri or Google Assistant. What was really convenient about the PolySync 20 is that there are three ways that you can actually set it up. So the first way is the mobile setup pairing. So you can pair the speakerphone with your phone. It directly connects through Bluetooth if you prefer to use it that way, especially for those of you who may not want to connect it directly to your laptop or a desktop. And it's just a lot simpler if you want to connect it right to your phone and be able to just use it as a speaker, whether it's during work, when you're on a meeting, or if you're just playing music on the side, which is also something I like to do when I'm working. The next setup is the corded setup, which is the one that I currently use. And this is just with a USB connection to your laptop, which is how I'm using it, which is probably the easiest way to set it up. I literally just plugged it into my laptop and it was good to go. The next way is with the USB adapter setup. So instead of using a cord, you can use the USB adapter directly, which provides the same functions, but a little less wires on your desk. Pairing successful. So now that the PolySync 20 is linked through my mobile, it's so easy for me to just listen to my favorite podcast, my favorite audiobooks, or of course, just my favorite music. I love listening to new songs through various different albums on Spotify. And of course, business audiobooks is one of my favorite. They have different audiobooks like Rich Dad Poor Dad, Atomic Habits, Eat That Frog. So for anyone who may not have an audiobook subscription, business audiobooks on Spotify is the perfect playlist for you. I definitely recommend. And it's free, of course, with a Spotify subscription. Otherwise, I think there's just ads, but Either way, free audiobooks and The Mindset Mentor is one of my favorite podcasts. It's all about positivity and, and your personal self-improvement. Lately, I've also been obsessed with Hamilton. I listen to this every single day, so that's also part of my life. 
continue world right now. There's civil unrest, there's supply chain shortages, there's recovering from a pandemic. It's still showing up to the gym and working out. It's doing it regardless. So if you guys want to get your own PolySync 20 speakerphone, you can check out the link in my description as well as in the comments to level up your game at work as well as a personal speaker. Whether you're in a meeting, listening to a podcast, just listening to lo-fi hip hop on YouTube. Thank you so much to PolySync for sponsoring. And let's get back to the video. All right, friends. So on this side of the desk, I have very basic lots of decor stuff and books so i just have my airpods glasses some little decor i got these rocks from when we went to Larray caverns in virginia here i just have two books i finished 10 percent happier and great women's speeches i just kind of pick up when i need some inspiration so it kind of just has a little spot on my desk this is my physical journal but i typically keep a virtual journal so most of the time i'm journaling online anyway but i have that there i would feel like writing something down this is actually my little piggy bank which i don't use too often but you know it's just a nice little thing to have on my desk of course sunscreen some perfume that i never use and then this little lip balm this little mirror in this corner here has some of my polaroids i have a bunch more but there's nowhere to put them on my desk without looking cluttered so just those two this one was from my 24th birthday and this one was from my trip to ocean city which was very recent and then I just have a few little knickknacks, these little plushies, and this whale, this Lego whale. And this plushie is from this MMORPG that I played since I was in elementary school. So a very, very long time. Next up is my standing desk, which is from FlexiSpot, and I believe I've already showed this on my channel before, but it is currently locked and I can unlock it. And basically, it is a pretty standard standing desk. If I decide to stand or sit, I usually have it a bit lower so I can sit, but you can also add settings to it, which is very convenient. I think I've only set number one, but typically I keep it at about 29. Here I just have a few magnets from traveling. These two were from my cousin when she went to Puerto Rico, and this one is from and this one is from Shenandoah Valley. And then of course this mysterious drawer, a mess in here. So typically there are days where I am more organized and less organized. Obviously, this is one of those days where I'm not as organized, but but this drawer is really my everything pile. I have pens, um, extra pairs of glasses, notebooks, I have some day quill, night quill, different converters. As well as as well as just miscellaneous things like scissors these are all of my sd cards this is my external hard drive and then just random miscellaneous little things in this drawer that i mainly use just for storage purposes so that is that Right, thank you guys so much for coming along with me on my desk tour video let me know if you have any questions in the comments below and of course don't forget to check out the polysync 20 also linked in my description and maybe a question for you guys who have stuck around till the end what is your favorite thing on your desk it could be your laptop some piece of decor or anything else that you want to share in the comments below thank you guys so much for watching and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and turn on post notifications I post videos every Wednesdays and Sundays at 12 p.m. And hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.